OK, so we use logarithms a lot in mathematics. Um, some actually more than others. And when I'm saying that, I mean depending on the base of the logarithm. It's very rare that I'll use log base 27, for example. Uh, log base 10 or log base 2, these are very useful. OK. Um, log base 10 um, has its uses, mainly because, you know, we've got 10 fingers. So log base 10 was often used a lot was often used a lot, okay, um, especially when logarithms were first being introduced. Um, the log base 2 is used because of the 2 being in binary, okay, so that gets used a lot as well in uh, computer science. But the one that mathematicians use a lot is log base e, okay, so we've, we've learned about the number e, OK, and we write log base e of x in another format. And the reason why is because um, it's written so often that we write it as ln of x, OK, um, the natural logarithm of x. Now, this natural logarithm of x okay so y equals ln of x looks like a logarithmic curve you know what log base 2 of x looks like now so here is ln of x okay and like uh, 2 to the x and log base 2 of x were inverse functions of one another, e to the x and ln of x are also inverse functions of one another. So here is y equals e to the x. Okay, so these two are inverse functions. Now what that means is that e to the ln of x so if you have ln of x and you look at e to the ln of x this will just be x okay so if you typed in to your calculator ln of 5 and then you did e to that number so e to the ln of 5 you would get 5 okay so the fact of doing the natural logarithm and then doing the exponential function they cancel each other out and you effectively get nothing. Okay. Well, you don't get nothing, but nothing has happened to the x. Okay. So, also, if you do the e bit first, and then you take the natural logarithm of that, well, you just get x again. And in much the same way, if you've got e to the 7, type that into your calculator, and then you do the natural logarithm of that, you should just get 7. So, e and then log cancel each other out, log then e cancel each other out, okay? And so this is how they are connected and this fact allows us to solve equations and go on and solve more problems, okay? So ln is a very important part of solving equations and solving problems that involve e.